So I am using art resin. We're gonna mix these two together. This is the hardener and the resin. We're gonna mix them together for three minutes. And then I'm gonna pour, which I already did, I poured my mica powders into these cups. And then I'm gonna pour the resin into them, mix them up, and I'll be back when I'm done because it's a lot of mixing. It's probably about 10 minutes worth of work. And I can't spare that on my videos since I don't have a computer. I'm only making 15 minute videos. Um, trying to raise money to get a art studio, like a, basically a shed so I can have an art studio instead of in my husband's garage that blows dust and smoke everywhere. Um, so if anybody would like a commission piece from me, please reach out to me at monicabarnesart at gmail.com. I really appreciate it. Uh, also, I am starting to set up an Etsy account. There's a few pieces on there, not too many, under Monica Barnes Art. Let me know if you have any questions or concerns. Okay, so I am mixing my resin up in this big, gigantic container. I use two of these mixing cups with the measures on the side, and I put, what did I put? I don't know what I put. I put a cup and a half. Does that make sense? No, there's way more than a cup and a half. Oh my goodness. I don't even know. I put, how many ounces? I don't have glasses on, you guys. I can't even tell you what I put. Okay. Hey everybody, I'm back and I'm all done mixing my resin up and my colors. So I have today blue sapphire from the color cottage and gold and white and green and totally teal so i have totally teal apple green sparkly white uh sapphire blue and gold fever and that's what i got gold fever you know it okay so this is the these are the colors that i'm going to use on here i ha i do have some extra resin in my cup um not a whole lot i would probably use that for one board but i'm gonna have to make it work for two so let me move my colors. I have to move everything away because I got stuff everywhere and this makes a mess. I am just throwing some clear on my boards. This actually um, helps move the other colors around a little bit. I'm just gonna do it with my gloves. It doesn't have to be perfect. Actually, this I should have put, the, I do this every time I do a double painting. I don't know why. Like, I sit there and tell myself, oh, I should have put them closer. This time I'm gonna actually move them closer. How about that? I don't know which way I wanna go with this. Okay. Definitely got to save a little bit of that for when I am done, just in case I need it. Same with all the other colors. I saved just a little bit in case I need it for something. This is my sapphire blue. I really like this color. It's so pretty. Man, I wish you guys could see these in person. If you've um, never seen a resin painting in person, you'd be blown away. They're so absolutely stunningly beautiful. And I think that's why I'm so obsessed with it, because I really am. I am addicted to resin painting. Where do I want this, you guys? I don't know. I wish I could hear you talk. Okay, so right now I'm just throwing the colors on wherever I am feeling it. I'm not going to leave it stripey like this. I'm going to blow dry it out. Okay, so I'm thinking about where I should put the white. <sighs> 
That's good. Sometimes I don't know what I'm doing until I'm there and I'm doing it. I'm going to heat it up a little bit and we'll go from here. Now I'm just crossing over some of my white so it's not like all white on top. I want it to basically be weaved in and out. I don't think that's going to matter because I think I'm going to blow dry this. Um, sometimes I'll heat gun it, sometimes I'll torch it, and sometimes I'll blow dry it. And today I'm in a blow dry mood, so I think that's what we're going to get. Still saving a little bit of color here. Um, I still didn't put my gold on because I'm still thinking about it. Okay, sorry you guys that the camera stopped again. For some reason I keep having issues with that. I thought I was still recording, but unfortunately I wasn't. Um, you just missed me using the heat gun a little bit on the painting. Now I'm adding my gold. I'm trying to freaking go back in that puddle there. Drive me crazy. That's what it wants to do. It wants to drive me nuts. My camera went off. Oh my gosh. Oh, I don't know how much I video, how much I didn't video, what you got, what you saw, what you didn't see. I've been on this for a while, so I'm hoping you saw something. If anybody would like to purchase my art. Okay, here you go. I am on a ladder. I'm at the top of my ladder. Hopefully I can get it all in there. I don't know what you're seeing because it's so high up. me know guys let me let me know what you think let me know your thoughts um If you liked my video, video, my video, my video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Everything that I use in this video will be listed below. These are pretty big. They're pretty big. I am stepping far away. Hopefully you can see it all. Okay, don't forget, give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.